Baba. Uh -huh. How are you? I'm good. A couple of questions. Which ones would you prefer? Sneakers or loafers? I've been using sneakers for a long time. Okay. Yeah. Um, if you were to go to a shop and you want to pick an impromptu gift for Mama Aida, would it be flowers or chocolates? She loves flowers. Okay. And she likes, uh, likes uh, red colors. So for you, a realistic Mona Inchi deliverable, would it be the 6,000 uh, social welfare or a wheelbarrow? Of course, uh, the wheelbarrow thing doesn't make any sense to me. Okay. Uh, I don't know who actually conceived it. Uh, and how it's meant to help the people. True. But, um, you know, we are talking about a serious issue. Okay. A social program. It's a social protection program. Yes. And th this is something which is uh, been a matter of debate in many societies. Right. How is to deal with the poor of the poor yeah. in a society. <laughs> so yeah. to me, it really it does not make sense. Okay. Even the so-called bottom-up mm. approach, yeah. I, I, I don't even understand it. You know, uh, I was, we are talking about dealing with the society in, in, in totality. Yes. You see, it's not a, a, a trickle-down, we understand, mm. that actually uh, helps to marginalize certain parts of the country. True. But, uh, you're not solving it with the so-called bottom-up. You just need to ensure that um, you are fair and there's equity in sharing of resources across the country. You want things to change, but then you find that uh, there are many other factors conspire to make you almost helpless in changing the, the situation. I, I am hungry, angry that our people still live in such abject poverty. Mm -hmm. So many years since independence. And I believe that this situation is actually correctable. And that uh, we've done mistakes in the past, and that is what is responsible for where we are. Given the opportunity to choose one ta, either Kayole, Nagureti, or Gidurai, which place could you choose at least to live in? Um, of course, the great is near me. Uh, <laughs> uh, uh, the favorite food to keep you up on Dani, no Kulalanini? Maybe to keep you up on Dani. No Kulalanini, Gideri, Gideri, no Kulalanini, Yamachoma. Only do a cheaper Mutu. A cheaper Mutu, dear. Cheaper Mutu. Then we have to keep a Kuru Kidogo too in Yanako, the great Yapo in Zakubamba. So, um, if you're having fish, what, what would you rather have? Fresh fish or dry fry fish? I prefer dry fry generally, yeah. but uh, there are times when I also love fresh uh, fish. Okay. Depends how it is cooked. Yeah. My, my mom was a very good fish cook. Mm -hmm. She knew, for example, how to select fish. She knew which fish is fresh, yes. where to touch to know whether the fish is fresh or not fresh. Okay. And uh, once she selected it, then she knew how to prepare it. So if not Kenya, which country in Africa would you live in or would you want to stay, stay in? I think Kenya number one, number two, or number three. Uh, Kenya, Kenya, Congo. Kenya Kwanza. Kenya Kwanza. Okay, tea or coffee? I'm a tea drinker. Uh, um, although Kenya produces uh, a very good quality c coffee, me, like most of other Kenyans, I'm a tea drinker. Of course, you know, I like reggae. And uh, as we said, uh, reggae is on, on uh, half time. <laughs> and you can come again, okay? But uh, they can play reggae, any, any song reggae. Yeah. And they can also play my uh, Belafonte. Mm -hmm. 